What's good, Internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to Let's Play the PlayStation VR Demo Disc. Today, got three more demos here for you. We got Hustle Kings, which is pool. We got Rigs, which is like a robot uh, shooter game. And Super Hypercube, which is a puzzle game type deal. So, let us find my controller here. I got my controller. I got my move controllers. Uh, and we're going to hit uh, X here for Hustle Kings VR. And apparently, I'm... Not going to play Hustle Kings VR because there's no play button. Why would you put it on the disc if I can't play it? The fuck, bro? Boo! Boo! Alright, well, I guess we'll try rigs. There's a play button. Rigs is an intense all action sport. Start with short play sessions, and then, well, it's a demo, so this is going to be a short play session. Please play rigs responsibly. Visor settings. New to rigs. Masks for maximum comfort or extended visibility. I'm going to go maximum comfort. Uh, even though I spent about a half hour yesterday playing Drive Club VR, and my stomach was fine, so no problems there. But this has motion in it, much like uh, Battlezone did yesterday. Uh, so I suppose that could be uncomfortable for some people. Uh, we'll see how my stomach does here in, uh, rigs. This is like esports shit going on right here. Okay. This is alright. Looking around. Here's my rig. Here's my rig. That's alright. What else is around here? That guy is doing some welding over there. What do we got? Uh, hey guys, we're in Dubai. Alright, now what? Okay. Hey, you're in my face there. Hey buddy. Yeah, fist bump, fist bump. No, no. Alright. That seems unnecessary. That seems wholly unnecessary. You couldn't just get on a ladder and climb in there? Like, oh, that's cool. I don't see any controller here. Do I have... Is it, is it moves? No, it's not glowing. What's going on here? Okay. Uh, oh, we're moving here. That's very shiny. What is happening? Oh, I guess I can look. That's kind of uh, a little bit of vertigo there. Power slam! What are you, Goldust? Randy Orton? Power slam. What's going on over here? Alright. There's some video playing over there. Is it like a game trailer playing over there? Hey guys! Hey! Hi! Got it. Alright, so basically, dunk yourself like a basketball. Okay. Good luck. Fame and glory await me. The Valkyries. Okay, let's see if this makes me nauseous or not. That is the, um... Hell yeah! This looks alright. Let's get it on! I have no idea what I'm doing. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great! What? I'm on the ground. Alright, I, I, I have a double jump. I can shoot. What? Screw you! This feels weird. I'm not sure that I like it or not. Like, the movement feels... Not cool, bro! Ejecting. Oh, I died. Press X to deploy. What? Where am I? They scored a goal. Like, I don't know. Like they they've limited the amount that you can look, which is weird. So you gotta get used to aiming and like 
the right stick only goes left and right. Which is... Yeah, this is... The controls here, I guess, would take some adjusting. It's not making me nauseous, which is great, but... Getting the controls to cooperate uh, is... No, I'm gonna die again. I... Not gonna make it. Not gonna... Yeah, get there! Yeah, go! Hey, buddy. Not sure if I have a thing or not. Oh shit! What happened there? What's happening? Nope. Nope, that was not it. Who's shooting me? Nope, I died. I died! Okay. I mean, this is alright. I can see how it'd be fun, you know, with your friends in multiplayer and that kind of thing, but I'm not super big on... Oh, it's halftime. Fireworks at halftime. Three to four, so we're losing here. Your team is losing. That's alright. Attack Slug. I made one, one goal. Okay. That's still like the feet hanging thing is really fucking me up. Second, second half or not? Oh yeah, I do. All right, we're still in it here. This wire's pissing me off. Okay. One more half of this game, and then we move on to uh, the next demo, and we'll we'll check back in on. Oh no, we won't, cause that's it. That's the whole that's the whole demo. That's weird. Hey, you want to play more? Buy the game. I mean, I've got it in my game fly. Maybe I'll get it eventually, but I don't know. Maybe I won't. I'm not big on competitive uh, multiplayer. I mean, it's got a single player component to it, and that's fine, but let's go check back in on Hustle Kings, and no. It's making a sound when I hit X, which is funny. And I'm not going to hit triangle because fuck you, but this is supposed to be a demo disc full of playable demos. So how the hell is Hustle Kings not on here? See, X is select. Browse doesn't work. Info. That's cool, but... Doesn't work. That's some fucking nonsense if you ask me. Anyway, Super Hypercube. Again! Why is there just a buy option? Are you effing kidding me? What is the point of having this on the disc if I can't play it, you goddamn pieces of shit? Alright, this is not really a game as much as it is a video to watch and kind of, I guess, look around in is from what I hear, so I guess we'll do that. That's gotta be some kind of a, 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 a that's gotta be some kind of a weird bug um, with that stuff, because you wouldn't put that on a demo disc and not actually have the demo that's playable, right? That's, that's insane. It's absolutely insane. The whole point is, hey, play our thing for five minutes, and then, you know, if you like it, then go buy it. That's, you know, the idea behind this whole disc in the first place. So, I don't know. I'm hoping that if I put the disc in and it's all from the disc, that it'll, it'll have what I want it to have, which is, you know, the demos. So, hopefully tomorrow I can play some Super Hypercube and some uh, Hustle Kings, hopefully. So, I'm still going to try to do three today, but... This is not really a game as much as it is a movie to watch, so... Let's watch this movie, I said, you know, I'm, I'm assuming it's about five minutes, but... I don't actually know. We'll find out here. Momentarily. This looks alright. It's a nice sense of depth here. To all these lights that are turning on. And whatnot. Some particles. Some particles. 
all around me. And title card. That's cool. This is actually a free uh, separate download by itself I had seen on the store, so you don't have to download the whole 40 gig demo disc to uh, make it happen. But here we are. Looking at that. Fragile. It's Italian. City in the clouds, we're in Bespin. Oh, hello. It's a weird, like, stop motion effect almost. It's kind of jittery. Kind of. Not as smooth as you would like it to be, but perhaps it's designed to look like stop motion. I don't know. It's weird. If I sit farther back, it'll be smoother. I, I don't think I need a controller. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, you can kind of like get right in there on that. Be like, hey! Oh, that's weird. Ah! Shouldn't have done that. I missed the thing. Yeah, it's like watching like living toys, which is really cool. That's really cool. It's like you almost want to like reach out and grab the toy and pick it up, and you kind of can't because you know it's it's the the clarity is you know not quite a hundred percent what you would want because you know the fidelity and whatnot, but it's still cooler than you know a lot of things out there. So I'll give it that. I don't want to get, like, if I, if I get too close, it gets kind of blurry, and I'm trying to get my eyes to focus on it. Whoa, that's too bright! Oh, God, I'm blind! I'm blind, what happened? One year ago. Meanwhile, in the Legion of Doom, and it's Noah's Ark. I don't know. What's going on? Yeah, it's a little jittery. Can I look inside this thing? Can I just, like, put my head inside? I totally can! I totally can. That's awesome. That's awesome. Like, your instinct is to okay, here's VR, how's this gonna work? And you can just be like, yo, hello, how you doing? I wish the motion was a little smoother, but that works. Oh, of course now it's just open. That works way better than I thought it would. Or funny. So, girl and her mom in an airship. In a magical airship. Okay. Look around this. Yeah, I can kind of get a good look in there into the cockpit. There's a table in there. I don't want to lock into my camera here. That'd, that'd be real bad. It'd be real bad. But I'm like tr trying to maintain and not fall as I'm trying to observe this VR. No, come back! I wanted to look more. All right, whatever, whatever. Bye. It's just the presence of VR, like how it makes you feel that you're inside of it. You just want to say hi and bye to everything. That's just my my my, my own instinct there. Like. I want to get up and walk over there, but I, I'm gonna walk into some, something in this room and I, sh I shouldn't do that, so I'm not, I'm not going to. I really want to get up and kind of be like, hey, mister. There's the airship. Mr. Top Hat Guy. And there's, you know, they're down there doing stuff, and there it is over there. Just gonna come on right into here. Hey. With some luggage. So I'm sure if I got up and went into this airship, I could still look inside there. I, I don't want to knock into my actual computer monitor over here. Or my camera over here. I think it's this way. I can't even tell anymore. I'm all, dis I'm all disoriented. But this is pretty cool. Like, this is definitely... If I, if, if I had more room to move around, 
this is an interesting way to tell a story uh, in 3D in, you know, VR. And she's, you know, a baton twirler. And there's the old man going, yeah, that's great. Fantastic. I'll make you a star, kid. Or is she going to sell them? Twenty bucks! Pay up! Pay up, fucker. Yeah. There you go. One shiny coin for that magical fucking sparkler. She's selling fucking fireworks. This is what's, what's going on here. And now... She's remembering about that awesome moment. And then everything went wrong, I guess? I don't know. Yep. Same town, though. And you're bummed. I get it, you're bummed. Yo, do not play with fire. Oh god. Oh god! And... Oh, watch the... F so, the full thing, you can download the full thing, uh, I guess for free. Or maybe it's just a demo, I don't even know. I'm not even sure. Maybe it costs money. I don't know. Let's see if we can quit here. So yeah, the buy screen for that, it is just a free thing, because I already downloaded it, so you can get the whole thing on PSN uh, for free, which is pretty cool. I'm going to watch that at some point and watch the whole thing. But, I promised the three demos, so let's head into this horror shit. It's Here They Lie. Okay, so this doesn't do anything. Uh, is my control... Well, what? What's going on here? What? One of these? Oh, god damn it. I'm all un... Hold on. Options. There we go. Okay. So, the motion here can be either the controller or the headset. And I'm going to stick with the controller. No. I'm going to stick with the headset. So I'm going to go options. And alright, we're, we're now centered. And then uh, you don't actually, like, you can move around, but looking around is you flick the stick to kind of do a little bit of a flick thing to move your vision. Which I've had games do before. I played through Dead Secret on Gear VR. And that was, you know, it was alright, but occasionally, uh, was, wait, what? Oh, okay, that does that. All the buttons just turn the flashlight off. I don't know why you want to, but, you know, it's there. The fidelity here on textures is not great. It's not terrible, but it's not great. So, I guess there's that. But yeah, sometimes you kind of don't want the game to um, let you use the right stick to turn, because that can make you real nauseous. I've had that problem before in in games in the Gear VR, and certainly in that World War Tunes garbage that I played and was very nauseous afterwards for several hours. So, I guess we're going this way. I suppose we are. Yep, no admittance. And frog dissection or something, I don't know. Things and stuff. Oh, hi, Mr. Guy with a fucking head of a koala. Oh. Yeah, this is kind of jittery. I'm not sure if it's just my, my layout here, but it's, that's really jittery. Not, not feeling that at all. And I was considering buying this first for, you know, because I was like, I could use a first-person horror experience in VR. That sounds like a fucking nightmare, but this is not great. Like, I'm not really, not really enjoying what I'm playing thus far. And I kind of had high hopes for this, so. Oh, well. Can I just get out of here now? Or no, like, whoa, God, I'm dead. I can't run. Yep. Hey, buddy! That sucks. Was that it? Was that seriously it? That's the whole demo?
No, it's not. I'm, I'm, I, I can still move? I can still move. Alright, so we've we've done a, a smash cut to something else. Where I am moving forward here into the sunset. And things are happening. We're going into the Stargate. Hey, buddy. Bye. Magical mushroom. Oh, it's a light bulb. Okay. What the fuck was that? What the fuck is that? Alright, I guess that was supposed to happen. Hey! Hi. I guess we're not done yet. Back to this shit. Okay, that's kind of disorienting a little bit. That's a little bit like, oh man, I feel, I feel like I'm, I'm falling forward now. Like, the, it feels like I'm leaning when I'm not actually leaning. That's a little bit jarring. Just a touch. Just a touch. Well, we're going in here again. Sorry. Fuck the police. That seems foreboding. What's over here? What do we got over here? Right, let's go look at this over here first. There's no run button, so it literally is a walking simulator so far. It's like, I cannot move any faster than this. None of the buttons are helping me out whatsoever. Oh, there's a note. Let's get that. That's nice. That's a underground shark of some kind. Hammerhead. What? Predominant, predominant, predominant the cosmos. Laugh about it, it's a joke. You know what? Fuck y'all. Peace the fuck out. Goodbye. But again, I'm walking away slowly because I can't run in this situation. Which you would kinda want to, right? I'm just gonna run because that seems like a bad scene with you know sh imaginary sharks and shit. Old timey cigarette machine. Get your cigarettes here. That one right there. That's old timey. Oh, I. That was real disorienting for a second there. What the fuck just happened? I was looking at a machine and it didn't really want to cooperate. Yeah, this is not a good feeling. This is not great. And part of it is just it takes so long to do a thing that it increases the feeling of not greatness. Like. I prefer to be at the bottom of these stairs by now, but I'm not, and that's really unfortunate. Like, the angle, if you, if you hit the wrong angle, it feels real bad. So I'm trying to not look all the way down these stairs. And also, I think I'm, I'm, un, I'm uncalibrated here, sort of, yeah. So it's, 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 it's picking up both the controller and my head, which is, like, pick one, you know? One or the other. And there's space. The vastness of space! Pigs in space! Uh, as far as I can go. So I'll turn around and... What? Don't make me go back up that fucking staircase. I swear to God. Please don't. Okay. What is the point of any of this? I can't move any faster here, which is like making this a... That, that, that's the scariest part. I can't move any faster. So should I be looking at anything in particular? Or... Nah? Or... Just space, bro. Just... Space, bro. Like, should I be looking for a... Star? No. I don't want to go back up the stairs. God damn it. Really? Really? Oh, there's a door here. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. There's a door. I'm an idiot. That's, you know, well established in this on, on this channel. Oh, shit, son. That door wants no part of this. 
Really? This way, and it, it, it doesn't open. Uh, okay, yes. Blood on the dance floor. Got it. Fire! Hey, buddy. That seems, uh... The Burning Man. Oh, come on, he, he ducked down. That's bullshit. Ah, crap. Okay, well... Are you gonna eat me? And then we're done? Yep, we're done. Nah. That gets a big fat meh from me. Meh. Anyway, that's going to do it for today for this VR, uh, you know, thing. I'm hoping tomorrow I'm going to do some research and find out whether or not uh, Super Hyper Cube and Hustle Kings are actually on this uh, disc or not. Uh, and I will make uh, a, a call from there. Anyway, thanks for watching. More videos every day. I'm a tax slug. See you next time, right here on this channel. And I'm out.